This is a special report from News 3 WSIL. Programming to let you know about a crash on Interstate 57 near Charleston, Missouri. Why don't you take a look at this map right here. This is Interstate 57. I'm going to throw this out real quick to you. When you get on the Missouri side here between Illinois and Sykes, just avoid this area altogether. That is closed down right now. Now the crash happened between mile marker 10 and 12. Now, according to the Missouri Department of Transportation, Interstate 57 once again is closed between Interstate or between Interstate 55 and Sykes and the Illinois line. I want to take a moment here just to show you this. Right here is Charleston, Missouri. For anyone that's been to Boomland, familiar with Boomland fireworks area, this is what we're talking about, that area. There is no way to get to that right now. This is all closed. And Sykeston, right here is Sykeston. This is all closed, both directions. Um, there's quite a few vehicles involved. We're hearing multiple reports, but we haven't had much confirmed on that. But take a look at this picture right here. This is, the, this is one of the pictures that we've been given permission to use by a viewer that is on scene down there. At, and as you can see, just multiple vehicles. We're not sure how many of those are involved in the wreck or how many of those are in this backup. But it is just a terrible scene from what we're seeing in this picture. In a Facebook post, Mississippi County Sheriff's Office says multiple agencies are on scene and many area ambulance services have been requested to assist with this crash. Right now, though, no word on injuries as of last update. Now, we do have multiple crews en route to this, and we're going to keep you updated. But I want to show you some alternate routes if you want to. Let's go back here to this map real quick. So if you're coming from Illinois going into Missouri, this is Highway 51 that runs through Cairo. Normally, you'll be able to bypass this by taking the bridge here across Mississippi River to 62 through Wilson City back over to Charleston there. That is closed down. There's, they've been doing construction. We've been telling you about this for days. We're not sure how much of this is just traffic that's trying to get around the area or construction. Now, the other alternate route is going to cost you at least 30 minutes. It's going to be quite a bit of time added to your day. Let's zoom out here on this map. I want to show you this real quick. Right here is Charleston. This is where our accident's at between 10 and 12 mile marker. This is Highway 55. Right here is Sykes, and you're going to have to go up. If you're coming from Illinois, you're going to have to take Highway 146 through Anna to Route 3, all the way down through McClure here to Cape Girardeau. And then you're going to get on exit 95, or it's going to be the 95 mile marker on Interstate 55, and you're going to take that south to Sykeston. So if you're coming from Illinois, you're going to go Anna, Cape Girardeau, down to Sykeston. Now, if you're coming from Missouri and you need to get in Illinois, you're going to do that just in reverse. It's going to be Sykeston, Cape Girardeau, and then to Anna. So there's going to be a long day here. There's going to be several hours while this is still backed up. And like I said, we've got multiple crews on the way down there. We'll be sure to keep you updated online and on air as more information becomes available. We're going to return you now to regular programming. This has been a News 3 special report. We've got you 